If your iPod Shuffle 4th generation is not turning on, seems frozen, and in some cases, even though it's charged but it won't power on, well in this video we'll show you what you can do in that situation to revive your iPod Shuffle. Now first of all, it happens when the battery is fully drained. So just go ahead, leave it on charge for a couple of hours. While charging, if it's not showing the LED, make sure you're using a functional charger or power source. You can change the charger, the cable, the power source if needed. Just ensure the device is charging. And while your iPod Shuffle is on charge, try to turn it on by sliding this power button. If it's just a charging issue, your Shuffle will turn on after that. Now, if it's suddenly powered up during playing a song, Make sure you haven't accidentally locked the button by pressing twice in this play and pause button. To unlock it and at the same time to soft reset the device, just turn it off, wait for around 1 minute and then turn it on again. Now, in most cases, if you try this through process, you'll be able to turn on your iPod shuffle. Now, if you're the one if still not working in your case, now just go ahead straight connect it with your laptop or PC. And make sure when you do so, the button is on turn on position. If iPod Shuffle is recognized by iTunes, just leave it there for a while. After that, disconnect from the computer. Although your problem should be solved after that, if you face it every now and then, take a backup of your song, hard reset your iPod Shuffle, and then restore all your medias and files back to the device again. We have a detailed video about all this process. If you want, you can check it out. Hopefully this video have helped you turning on your iPod Shuffle. Thanks for watching.